Okay, so right now, um, I'll be giving you guys a slight tutorial on how to get to uh, Fernbrook Gardens in uh, Portofino South. Okay, so um, this is going to be somehow uh, a bit confusing, but okay, uh, it's not an issue if you guys use Skyway or not. Um, either ways, you need to get to uh, Alabang Exit. So for those who won't be taking Skyway, um, this uh, this tutorial is uh, for uh, people who are bringing their uh, private vehicles, but it could be also useful for those who will be taking public transportation. So all of you guys will be exiting at Alabang Exit. For those who will not be taking um, the Skyway, you guys will be exiting here at Alabang Southbound Exit. So after you exit at this toll booth, this is also a toll booth, the, the, both of them are toll booths, uh, you can use any toll booth there, but um, I would suggest you use this one, <laughs> personally, whenever I go to Alabama. Anyway, um, you have to exit, after you exit there, you'll be passing through RCBC here, then after you pass through RCBC, you need to turn right at Montillano Street. After turning right at Montillano Street, you have to turn left here at Corporate Avenue, so that's the first major intersection you'll be at. So you need to make your way at Corporate Avenue, and this will be Festival Mall as per reference. Okay, guys, so after turning at Corporate Avenue, you need to turn right at Commerce Avenue. So that's going to be the second intersection, second major intersection after you pass through this bridgeway here. This is uh, called Bridgeway. I don't know why it's Bridgeway, but don't ask me. So you need to turn right at Commerce Avenue, then you need to tread Commerce Avenue all the way down to the Anghari. You'll pass through Alabang Town Center. This is APC. Then you'll head through here at Danghari. Once you're at Danghari, that's going to be easy. Okay, so let's stop there. For people who'll be using Skyway, um, it's a bit more trickier for you guys because um, you won't be able to take this route here because this is supposed to be Corporate Avenue. But for those who'll be exiting Skyway, uh, by experience, I don't think you'll be able to turn left here because this will be an underpass. Remember, if you exit Skyway, you have to merge through the service road here. Or else you'll be going through Alabang Zapote Road. You need to make a right here at Bridgeway. So the only way for you to turn right at Bridgeway is to merge at the service road here. So remember, after you exit, after you exit um, Skyway, uh, your exit will be somewhere around here, um, upper there. But you have to exit and merge to the service road. It's going to be a small um, roadway. It's going to be a small um, opening once you get down from the bridge from Skyway. It's going to be a small opening there. Then after that, you have to turn left here at Bridgeway. This is going to be the call center park or a business center. I'm not quite sure, uh, but you, you don't need to know that. You need to turn left at Bridgeway. Then you can make your way to Commerce Avenue. I don't care if you use um, Spectrum Midway or whichever uh, roadway here. But if you don't want to get lost, you can go straight all the way down to um, Festival Mall, then turn right at Corporate Avenue, then turn right at Commerce Avenue. Okay, so now we're all on the same track. For those who will be taking public transportation, you need you. this is South Station here. All the buses from Metro Manila, from Mega Mall, will be stopping at this area here. This is South Station. From the map that um, Cosplay Network Philippines gave you, this is supposed to be, I think, the blue rectangle. I'm not quite sure, but um, this is South Station here. If you guys uh, are going back to Metro Manila, to Major Metro Manila, to Mega Mall, you need to go here at Star Mall Alabang, or this was formerly a festival mall. This is the major bus station here. Uh, for reference, if you need some reference, there's a Sogo somewhere here. Yeah, me so good, Jen. Anyway, <laughs> um, for those who'll be taking public transportation, uh, the Jollibee that Cosme Network Philippines is saying is around here at this area. So there's also a red ribbon if you guys need to buy some cakes or what whatnot. And then um, the van terminal is here at Alabang City Terminal. This is the provincial bus terminal. So you'll pass through a quote unquote park, which I don't think is a park here. This is this will be a major jeepney road here, and also this one. This is a one-way street going back to um, the Alabang Viaduct. So this here is the van terminal going to various places in Alabang, and um, you can also get a van here going to the Anghari. Okay, so now we're all on the same track. For those who are um, taking their private vehicles, you have to be um, very much 
alert here at Commerce Avenue. You need to stay at the middle lane because there are some lanes here that turns left and you might get a ticket from um, Alabang Police and Traffic. Okay, so now um, we'll focus now at Danghari here. So Danghari is very simple. You just need to go straight. Um, there's a speed limit now, but uh, it doesn't matter, I guess, because I usually go through around here 70 kilometers per hour. So that should take you around 10 minutes to 15 minutes to get to the Angrena. Okay, so once th this is Commerce Avenue, you need to turn left at Danghari, then you need to just go all the way straight to Danghari until you see the Petron Station. Okay, so this here, this area here is going to be a bit more tricky because this is a, a rough road, a sort of rough road, because and uh, most of the traffic bottlenecks here. So this will be a traffic bottleneck for everyone who's going to Fernbrook. But once you go past through here, it's going to be a bit, it's going to be a wider road. This will be a, a Caltex gasoline station, I think, if I'm not mistaken. Okay, so um, once you're here, it's free-flowing. Uh, you pass through around one or two traffic lights, I guess. But uh, you can speed up until um, 80 kilometers per hour if you think that's safe for you guys. You'll be passing through some signs that you'll be passing. Uh, you'll be passing along uh, correctional facilities or whatnot, and this will be a traffic light intersection here. If I'm not mistaken, yes. Yeah, so you just need to continue on Danghari. So Danghari, 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 and then this point here will be the Patron gasoline station. That that will be the landmark for those who'll be taking public transportation, both public and private transportation. This is the Petron gasoline station here, and there will be a police outpost also here, but I don't think that could be seen because the last time I went there, I didn't see this outpost. <laughs> okay, so you need to turn left here. For private vehicles, you need to turn left. Take caution because vehicles here go through fast, very fast. For those who are uh, taking public transportation, you need to drop, get yourselves dropped off here around Petron gasoline station. If you see another Patron gasoline station and along Danghari, then you might have passed it already. But the Patron gasoline station is on your left side, so be attentive, guys. Be attentive. Okay, a few meters to go after you turn left there will be Fernbrook Gardens, which is right around here. So it's quite easy if you know if you have a if you have a private vehicle going here to Fernbrook Gardens. But if you don't, uh, it's quite tricky. So be attentive. Don't be afraid to talk to locals. Don't be afraid to don't be shy. Um, I think uh, we'll be trying to get some public transport here like trikes or um, pedicabs or whichever local transportation is available for the area uh, to get you guys going to Fernbrook Gardens. Easy, right? If you guys need to get back to Fernbrook Gardens, um, I mean to uh, Metro Manila to Mega Mall, same route. <laughs> you just need to go back up Danghari. There's no one-way streets. Going back up to Danghari, then to Commerce Avenue. Build up of traffic again. We'll be starting around in this area here before the uh, next. Uh, oh, wait, no. Uh, around here before the Caltech station up here. And then but, uh, it's going to be a bit traffic if um, there's a lot of vehicles because of the um, rough road here. Then you need to go back to Commerce Road. Oh, Commerce Avenue. Then if you want to hang out at Festival Mall, you can do so, or Alabang Town Center. Then you at, Alabang, at Festival Mall, turn left at Corporate Avenue. Now, if you're using private vehicle, be attentive again, because um, Muntinlupa traffic is much worse than Manila. So you need to turn right here at this random road. <laughs> Don't forget, if you cross, that's going to take you to Skyway. So if you guys want to take Skyway again, you just need to go back at Bridgeway. You need to turn left at Bridgeway. Then turn right at Alabang Zapote Road, then take the, the overpass or the flyover going to Skyway. Now if you're going to take um, the regular route, you need to turn here, then make a U-turn after um, Star Mall, then keep right, then merge along Alabang Northbound Entrance, and that takes you back to South Luzon Expressway. So if you guys have any questions, you can email us at info at animelines.asia or you can contact also Cosplay Network Philippines at cnph at ymail.com. So um, if you have any more questions, you can also post it at our fan page or at the event page as well. You can check out our website as well at fantasyquest.animelines.asia. Thank you very much and this has been Michael. I hope the tutorial has been very helpful for you guys.